Connor Wilson from LaxAllStars.com. Today I'm going to teach you how to create a weatherproof traditional bucket. As we said, we're going to teach you how to make a weatherproof traditional pocket today. And we're going to do that using baby oil. Now you do have another option, and that's to actually buy weatherproof leathers. Throw on a string has a great option for you in that case. But if you want to learn how to do it at home, well, this is how we're going to do it. So you take a leather before you string your pocket and put down a piece of paper towel. Now you're going to very lightly and at a slight angle seep out a small amount of baby oil and run that bottle down the side. I prefer the three ounce bottle of Johnson's and Johnson's baby oil. It works fantastic. It doesn't let too much come out and that doesn't oversaturate your leather. When you've done it correctly, you'll see just a little bit on the front of the letter seeping through, but the back and the sides are really quite saturated. You can go too far with this. Here's an example of going way too far. There's too much baby oil on this leather. A, it's gonna take a long time for this leather to dry out and be ready for it to shrink. The other issue here is that sometimes too much baby oil can really corrupt the process. So try to avoid that. Now maybe you've already strung your pocket and it's not treated. Well that doesn't mean that you can't rub a little baby oil onto the leathers. Again, you want to avoid putting on too much baby oil and don't put any on the cross lace if you can avoid it. That can kind of rub off on the ball and, and make it slippery, which takes things a little bit too far. A little bit of baby oil goes a long way, so be very judicious in how much you use. You'll be able to take that pocket outside and play with it in any condition.